Hi, my name is Jeff Jacob. I'm the director of the IP hardware PLM team here at Nokia. I have beside me an S7750 SR12e, and we'll talk a little bit about some of the enhancements that we're putting into the SR uh, product portfolio that includes the SR1, SR7, SR12, as well as the 12e. In the far side of the chassis here, we have an IOM 5e, one of our FP4-based line cards that plugs into this platform. Uh, it accepts two MDAs. Some of the new MDAs that we have here are 16 ports of native 10, 25 gig that also support MacSec, plus two ports of 100 gig. We have a six port 400 gig card here that supports six ports of QSFP 56DD, three ports of CFP2 DCO for supporting 100 gig or 200 gig clear channel. Those can be mixed and matched in any position, any slot here in the SR12e. They're equally shareable with our existing SR1, SR7, and SR12. We have also on the far side here, uh, eight ports of native 10, 25 gig that also supports MacSec. This is a new FP3-based uh, MDAE. It will be supported on the SR7, 12, 12E, as well as the SRE product series. So continued investment even with the SRE when it comes to this MDA in particular. Again, some great options to be able to put together new combinations of different pluggable interfaces when it comes to uh, options in the product portfolio. Specifically with the SR1, two of these MDAs in the SR1 really make for a very nice combination in that platform where we can have up to 32 ports of native 10 gig and four ports of 100 gig, uh, gig with leading scale and leading capacity in that platform, plus the ability to mix and match CFP2 DCO in a compact 2RU platform with the SR1. Very nice additions that complement what we can do with the SR12e here.